Hi, digital marketers. My name is Faisal Amin. Welcome back to my channel. Today, we are trying to enable Shopify data layer with Google Tag Manager. And go back to the Shopify admin sections and themes. And you see, here is the three dots. Click it and edit code. First, you have to create a new snippet. Add a new snippet and file name will be the ultimate data layer. Copy the ultimate data layer and paste the file name done uh, we are creating ultimate data layer liquid snippet and here we see ultimate data layer liquid file copy the total code and back to our edit code sections and paste the code and save it and now we back to theme dot liquid file in the head sections we have to put the gtm code so go back to our google tag manager and this is my shopify browser site container click on the gtm code and copy the total tag copy it and back to the shopify theme liquid file and paste it and under the gtm code we have to connect the ultimate data liquid file in dot liquid file so we are copy the render ultimate data layer and paste it the under the gtm code in theme dot liquid file paste it and save we are almost done we have an another work for the checkout and purchase sections then exit from here and go to the settings and finally our destinations checkout under the checkout sections, we have a put a code in the additional script sections. Again, we are back to the GitHub, copy the code, and under the additional script, we have to paste the code. And finally, we have to put our GTM code here. So we have to back in the GTM container and copy the GTM code and paste it and save it. Our work is done. And if you go to the Google Tag Manager, let's have to examine that our Shopify data layer is enabled or not. Then preview sections continue. And that is our Shopify partner website. Go to the product page as a view content event. Click it and back to the Google Tag Assistant. Here, see, that's looking great. View item event is working. And click the to cart button for the to cart event. Click it and back to the google tag assistance look see that to cart event is working and here see we are finding the all information of the product and and again click the checkout and back to again tag assistant begin checkout is perfectly working finally the purchase event so we have provided some dummy informations name first name click the pay now button back to the google tag assistance here see finally purchase event is working perfectly if you again go to any product page and click the simple data layer google chrome extension and click it here see uh, in the event of view item sections you can find the any kind of product information you can send the any parameter for any digital marketing platform so finally we have to enable the shopify data layer with google tag manager thanks for watching i will see you in the next video thank you